So we have a list of questions. It's more like an FAQ session. Um, and for starters, I think the biggest thing or the misconception on my side uh, as well, and feel for you to chime in as well, is the difference between marketing versus branding. And that you could probably do a whole six hour series on. But in short, like to me, marketing uh, is more when you have a tangible product that you want somebody to, to buy, right? Exactly. Um, whereas branding is more about um, knowing, letting people know who you are and what you do. Uh, to me, that's the, the simplest way to answer the question. But what I've found, especially in Japan, is that there's a fine line between what marketing teams do and what, let's say, the recruiting team or the HR team or the talent acquisition team should be doing for employer branding. Um, that's my biggest pain point, and I know that like a lot of the clients that we work with, we have you know kind of mission creep sometimes between what marketing wants and what what the branding should be and those kind of things. So. Yeah, for starters, I mean, what, what's your conception of marketing versus branding? Or what's your definition or what's your insight between marketing and branding? I mean, I, I do think that a lot of people will interchange them without realizing that, uh, you know, they can be two, two different concepts, but some people are, are unaware of the differences between branding and marketing. Um, when it comes to budgets, though, I think that's... that can be another issue too, where does the marketing budget apply to branding for a company or is there a separate budget for, uh, for branding uh, that's unique in that case? Mm -hmm. um, which can sometimes, I think, cause some, some confusion, especially like initial talks with a client. Uh, you know, you need to find out where that money is coming from and which budgets they can allocate to your product or what we're trying to make for them. Definitely. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, I agree. Uh, exactly. And, and, and I think sometimes, you know, if you imagine it like a Venn diagram where you have marketing and uh, employee brand or employer branding and where they intersect, you can see how employer branding actually supports marketing and, and marketing is a way of, of communicating uh, some of the employer branding as well, because uh, you want your customers to know who your company is and what they represent, I think, you know, so it's a... Definitely, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Do you come across that as well, Dermot? Uh, I come across it a little bit, and again, I come across the confusion sometimes about the difference between the two, but in my mind, it's the uh, marketing is all of the tools of selling and promoting yourself to the marketplace and getting them to understand what it is you have to offer. Whereas the branding is really about who you are, what you are, what you stand for, and how you differentiate yourself from others in the market. So. I feel the two go side, side by side, but they are different and there has to be a, a, a clear focus on each of them in order to develop and have them be strong in the marketplace. Yep, no, definitely. And you know, going back to that, like if we were working with a, a client or when we work with a client, it's more about, <clears throat> you know, there, there may be only video components or there may only be marketing components or just photographic components as well, right? So it gets a bit more complex right. uh, in terms of what you want to do. We're gonna come back to a lot of the photography points as well, but probably the bulk of it is uh, gonna be spent on, on the video and the media process, but. I, I do think that when people think of marketing, they're more inclined to consider things like like video and photography, that that kind of naturally yeah, uh, the leads visual. to those things. Yeah, visuals. Whereas with branding, it's a little bit more vague to a lot mm -hmm. of, uh, uh, companies and people, they don't, they're maybe not quite sure about how those uh, creative uh, outlets can be used for, yeah. for their it, employer branding. It's like you get a bit of the ideological side in the branding, whereas like you were saying, you know, with um, branding and marketing have so much visual, so many visual aspects, but the branding is, is where you can talk about who you are and, and what you believe in and, and what you represent and that. Yeah. So, you know, for, for all intents and purposes, I think what we should do is, you know, our version of what is the difference between marketing, and then I'll, I'll leave that with a definition or something, and branding, and then they'll do that, yeah. Um, yeah, so maybe just put a definition of marketing and branding up. Yeah. Our, our definition, like, so, yeah. Sounds good, yeah, yeah, I think that would be right. a good way to 
clarifying okay. what we said. Cool.